The passengers and crew of flight PS752 didn't stand a chance. Minutes after takeoff, the Ukrainian International Airlines flight from Tehran to Kiev went down in a city suburb. Recovery teams picked through what's left of the plane and people's lives. Most of the dead are Iranian. More than 60 Canadians were also killed, many reportedly students returning from vacation. The Boeing 737-800 was less than four years old and had been recently serviced. Video on social media shows a light hurtling to the ground and then a fireball. Iranian officials say there was no distress call. Fortunately, it didn't crash in the residential area, but the wreckage has scattered around into gardens and villas within a large radius. Nobody has survived. At Borisville Airport in Kiev, the arrivals board bears the grim news. This mother and father had been waiting for their son to arrive. My son is a senior flight attendant. My daughter called at 6.15 this morning to say that in the U.S. they were reporting that a plane had crashed, a Ukrainian international airlines plane. Ukraine's now cancelled all flights over Iran. The country's embassy in Tehran initially blamed engine failure for the crash, but later removed the statement. We made a decision to suspend all the activities of all Ukrainian aviation companies in Iranian airspace until the causes of this tragedy become clear. The crash comes amid heightened tensions across the region, following a US drone strike that killed top Iranian general Hassem Soleimani. In a sign of worsening ties, Iran's Civil Aviation Authority says it will not give the black box flight recorder to U.S. plane maker Boeing for analysis. It's not clear which country Iran will send the box to. And they pass all the safety audits and they've had no accidents whatsoever. So they really do tick all the boxes as a very, very good airline. But I do believe it'll be mechanical or possibly, it may possibly be a terrorist act. It's, it's too hard to tell at this stage. The crash is a major setback for Boeing that struggled to regain trust after the grounding of its 737 MAX aircraft following two fatal air crashes within five months. The Boeing 737 is one of the most popular aircraft in the sky with a good safety record. Investigators must now determine how and why so many lives ended here. Neve Barker, Al Jazeera.